I'm going to show you how to make this paper clip ice skates. I used a 2.75 hook and I used size 10 thread yarn. The pattern is down below and the paper clip is just a few inches across. Okay, so let's get started. So to get started, I'm going to slip knot onto my hook and if you need the video to go slower, you can place it in slow motion on your video or your phone. The video for that is down below. Now insert your hook, grab the yarn and pull it through. Then yarn over and pull through two loops. Now single crochet eight more times for a total of nine. Make sure that you have a couple of single crochets past that first part of the metal of the paper clip, which I'll show you in the video. Now chain two and turn, work a double crochet in each stitch across, yarn over, insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over, and pull through two loops, and then pull through two loops. Chain two and turn and work one double crochet in the next five stitches. You can work it right in the same stitch as the chain two. And then in the next four stitches, work a double crochet. chain one and turn and work your single crochet in the next five stitches. Now add a new color and chain one and work one single crochet in the next five stitches. Chain two and turn and work one double crochet in each stitch across.
chain 50 this will attach to your other skate your other skate you'll make the same exact way except for you'll stop when you get to the white part and finish it off once it's attached so you're going to attach your chain 50 with your other skate your other skate is going to be done the same exact way and you're going to attach it I think on this one I did make it with six stitches, but I think it's best with five. So if this one looks a little bit bigger, then you're just going to do it the same exact way. Just work your five stitches across with your single crochet. Then chain two and then work your double crochet across just like you did on the previous skate on the white part then fasten off and weave in all of your ends with your yarn needle just pull it through and then weave in your ends Okay, so this is what it looks like when it's finished. Um, these look great on a tree or Christmas present. They're fun to make, great for beginners. Um, I hope you enjoyed the patterns down below and thank you for watching.